I think it's recording. I think it's the day before Thanksgiving and I'm going to do number three. Hopefully I can catch this whole creek, Jeans Creek, and maybe come down James. This is number three. Yeah, let's try number three. I was going to do it on Thanksgiving tomorrow, but we're going to try it today, you know. So here we go. So what's up? Oh, I'm going to try these sticks too. I'm going to try something different. I'm going to try and try something different. Take my time a little. I don't know. I'm going to try walking sticks. They they work good. I tried them because I wanted them to come in down hills. Well, we'll explain sticks later. Ha! <laughs> you know, two sticks to make fire in the old days. And then I, I ran and yell, ha, <laughs> two sticks, two electrodes for energy. Two sticks. I like these. These are like, I think they're 60. I want them a little bit taller. Uh, anyway, uh, but I love them. Um, it's a good upper body workout too, you know? So anyway, you know, I'm coming on this trail. It's a bike trail. In the old days, this wasn't here. And I wasn't really trespassing. You know, I would just walk across the railroad tracks in the old days, you know, and, uh, and I would do my thing. You know, come around. You go up around that mountain, see coming down that way, that's James Run, or called Glen and Oka Falls. And I'm going to go over there. Gene, Gene's going that way, feeds another creek that comes in, I guess, right there. Across the, uh, across the river. Hey, okay, we'll take a good look here. So anyway, I mentioned on the first video, I believe, I mean, I witnessed it myself. Somebody, somebody was standing on such a precarious, weak and yeah, weak and piece of wood, two by ten, whatever, lateral plank, and poor, poor thing was looking over the river, and it was just an accident ready to happen and pulled her off. You know, but how many others? Who knows? And then they built this beautiful thing, of course. Yeah, and but they put a fence up. You know, because you can't blame them for putting a fence, but. But that's the way I used to go. I go this way, you know? That's probably what the red man or whoever back in the old days said. They say, I, I go hunt the deer, I go this way. And, but that white man, he said, no, 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 no. We traded the land and I got a fence here, man. Whatever, okay. All right, let's see. I had the music, I don't feel like music right now. Maybe I'll play some music, but maybe we'll just keep it quiet. I'm just gonna take a stroll. Could always dub music in later. I was jamming. Anyway, sun's out. Clear. Yeah, I was gonna check the weather. Thanksgiving. You know, there's no hunting on Thanksgiving. I didn't want to take a chance, but I, I put on a little bit of red. You need what is it? 250 square centimeters. I don't even know centimeters anymore. I grew up in America. I still like the square inches. Who was the foot? How did it go anyway? What, did King George he put the foot? He said, the foot is the foot. Then that's the way it goes. Hey, you, you got to bust a move, you know. Don't just sit there, stupid. Uh, you got to bust a... I got to think, do I got everything? I, mean, I got a car. I got two legs. I'm breathing so far. I think the camera's working. Yeah, I'm moving. Uh, you know... You usually should take water on the trip. Some other things, but I usually like to push it. But everybody else, whatever. Um, oh, I remember getting... Look at this area. I remember getting stuck in the Grand Canyon once. Had to stay overnight in the middle. At the bottom. I did find water eventually, but... Sure did dry my lips up like... Like uh, Blondie did on the Good, the Bad, and the Ugly when he had to go through the desert. Remember when Tuco pushed him through? Look at this. And that nice Lehigh River. Cutting through, flowing. Uh, I think it's... Hmm, man, I don't remember. It could be 600 feet above uh, sea level. This here, I think, you know, it's got a ch -ch -ch down to zero. Zero feet above sea level, down to sea. You know, down here to Easton. I think I said 20 miles once on the film. I think it's a little, it's less, 15, 10, <laughs> whatever. Not the way the crow fly, I guess, right? You got to wiggle. 
and then it's got a fall series you know gravity i think it's 600 feet i don't remember any more of the numbers i had 2.5 neuron cells I, I think that's down to 2.32 whatever uh yeah i want to take a hike today i probably shouldn't push it i think i yanked out two teeth yesterday well, i had to be done you know you got to watch it you know what do you think you're gonna do you know, you're gonna be but daffy duck consequences consequences what do you think you're gonna hang out with tony montana what are you gonna do you know there's consequences oh boy tefillin tefillin oh yeah let's okay all right now let's see if we can get them get some let's just go make yeah, I don't know. yeah let's check my uh check my uh composure yeah well the railroad people leave me alone all right i guess the gates gates are open and closed by whoever let's see whatever happens all right here we go this is number three i got a jacket to be found i do got an extra battery this time and a bigger sd card and i got two sticks you know in the old days i mean i would never carry the sticks just use my hands everywhere um i like the sticks definitely coming down but definitely going up lately at steep hills because well you know i like to probe snakes yeah it gives me a little distance on the ground and it's a good workout using the using the sticks um now the crick i would have never i would have never thought it Woo! Yeah. well look at see yeah i'm still playing around you know a little foggy yet thought that was a snake yeah whatever you know what do you want this is a well joe and i think i think we killed that snake maybe packers point yeah uh, three mile the crow fly killed one there three mile packers point crow flies eagle flies yeah he took a whack at my buddy joe we killed it he's got it hanging up Two miles off of there, I'd say close. Woo, one of those days, man. Two miles to the left, I gave a story about the big snake hiking with my son. Whew. Drugs. You gotta watch out. I always said that to my nephews, who I love, my son. And I said it to anybody openly. I'll never lie. Of course, moderation, everybody know. Whew. Drugs. Yeah, well, I was playing with Tony Montana past couple years were a little rough you know it wasn't like the old days they tampered it now you know, not like the old days you know when the Germans used it to invade Poland with the RAF stay awake all day all night they can do a bomb and run yeah they invent stuff and then World War II and the chemists whoo they really pushed it made drugs and of course we were guinea pigs who else are you gonna use yeah it's good to People got pissed off because then we started using monkeys and well whatever people get pissed off at that now what are you gonna do but many generations of sacrifice oh hold on i'll get back to the drug story see you know this was always here i don't know they move things around now this is new man it connected yeah see in the old days this wasn't here of course look at that they did bypass the other one completely i'm not quite sure but whatever the railroad people are doing something um i just want to film i just want to film this thing complete i want to film it complete jeans run i want to go up there i want to go up that slit up and over private pile up and over then uh glenoka falls james g gene and james sitting in the tree k-i-s-s ING first comes love Woo! well I guess it went down close to 20 Whew. you know it goes below 20 oh you better watch your pipes that's when the expansion of the water can really bust your pipes 
I witnessed it in the plumbing and hydraulics field. Now listen to me, I, they still didn't batten down the hatches in one area. Gonna get it. Procrastination, it'll always get you. Woo! Deer tracks. Uh, that's a great sign. Hopefully it gets, hopefully all I do is spook the deer out with my, and these co colorblind hunters. Hopefully Dick Cheney's not out here. He'll probably shoot me anyway. He's like, yeah, oh, of course that was a deer. He's standing up, licking the tree or rutting it. It was on two legs. Yeah, I'll tell you what. Oh boy. Well, there's some close calls. And I don't really advocate carrying a gun. I sometimes do when the Rocky Mountains definitely feel better. Yeah, you know, I guess God controls everything, but people get attacked and I definitely felt better in the Rockies. I felt like I was being stalked by a mountain lion. I seen scat nearby, you know, droppings, fresh. It just felt like something was watching. But whatever was watching also felt, I pulled out my SIG, SIG Sour 45, and snapped it action. I was going up a steel cable along uh, Rocky Mountains. It was part of an electrical something line feeding a gondola. I wanted to go up this steep thing and then take the gondola down. Oh, that's the greatest thing. Go hike up the Rockies. Hopefully they got a, some kind of little restaurant at the top. Get yourself a little something to eat. You know, refreshment after your hike. And then take the gondola down. I mean, I know I used to 